We participated in this uh, historic charter meeting of Tempe, TP, mm -hmm. and uh, we're very excited and hopeful that this global network can link farmers and researchers at a practical level to make a difference for the planet. Yeah. I think we need TP because uh, we need an exchange platform in, on an international level. At the moment there is quite a few things going on, particularly also in Europe, but on an international level it's not coordinated. And TP could be a very good chance to coordinate the research, but also the needs of the practitioners. Well, I think TP is a great initiative to bring farmers, advisors and researchers from all over the world together to define a common shared research agenda, research and innovation agenda that then can shift, change the, the, the research agenda at the global level for the benefit of uh, organic farming and the public good. What I hope that TP can deliver to me is good arguments, good scientific arguments, so I can influence the debate in the Netherlands on the quality and uh, achievements of organic. Uh, Tippy can act as a interpreter, as a translator um, uh, to, uh, for these scientific results and to give clear answers with a translation of scientific language to more farmers oriented language. What I'm in really interested in is that we interest people outside the organic movement and we present ourselves in a way that people and organisations outside the movement want to join in with because that's how we're going to join forces and be stronger as a global movement. So we're talking about being attractive to the agroecological movement, to the food sovereignty movement, because we've all been working in isolation, these different alternative movements. And I think it's really time we have to get together because uh, the industrial agriculture sector is clearly trying to put on a lot of force at the moment. So I'm a board member of ISOFAR and ISOFAR is an association of scientists. And uh, as ISOFAR, we like to support TIPI TP as a stakeholder driven association of IFOAM and then we come closer, science and practitioners to have more strengthening for going organic. Yeah, the initiatives, uh, it's uh, I think uh, very, very um, important to connect uh, researchers from different parts of the world and yeah, uh, ex for exchanging knowledge and experience surrounding new projects. So what I expect from TP, which is really important to all of us all over the world, is that we have a platform to where we can organize uh, the research, both from the farm level all the way through the valley's chain, to where it really benefits those who want to come into agriculture, organic agriculture, to learn about organic food processing in the marketplace, and really have a central place to go to not only see good research, but viable research that's refereed and can stand up against the best. That's what I hope. I believe that TP will provide an opportunity for the researchers and institutes uh, in developing countries to link uh, at worldwide level with their counterparts in developing countries as well as developed ones. TP will play an important role in linking African organic initiatives to other initiatives in other continents and um, also ensuring that more research is done within the African context. Global platforms have to aim at global actors and we have to, this initiative has to decide what it wants to achieve, who it wants to get, who it wants to reach and some potential targets could be the Gates Foundation could be and trying under, influencing their agenda on how they want to help African farmers out of poverty because that's what they want to do. Very innovative approach at global level and uh, to put, let's say, the farmer in the center of uh, research and innovation, to have this participatory approach, to involve them practically in defining also the needs and the priority of uh, the research in organic farming, it's very important. And I declare that TP is a chance that we're coming from scientific impact to real impact. And that is the best on the platform of iPhone.